Well, a ballot recount will start today after an Ash Grove school bond issue failed by just a handful of votes in the April election. Color 10's Joshua Panetta is live for us this morning at the Greene County Election Center to explain this recount process. Josh, good morning. Jesse, good morning. Greene County Clerk Shane Scholler says this is the first time that he's seen a recount over a school bond issue. I spoke with a few Ash Grove residents who says they hope this recount shows enough yes votes for Proposition Kids. I want your school to be good. You go to other schools and they have new facilities and we want to keep up with them. Proposition Kids would improve outdated facilities, expand classroom space and build a new gymnasium. The bond issue received 56.66% of yes votes. It needed at least 57% for the $9.4 million bond to be approved. Now, the Ash Grove School District is unique as it serves three different counties. It passed in Greene County, it passed in Dade County, however, it did not pass in Lawrence County. Now, each clerk from those three counties and their staff will recount each vote by hand. I spoke with a recent high school graduate from Ash Grove who says she wants her sister who's still in school to be able to have new amenities. Ash Grove's going so much bigger and I think that for the parents to know that each kid's safe and they're having fun, I think these upgrades are probably really important to have. The recount in Greene County will begin at 10 a.m. and will continue until each vote is counted by hand. Reporting in Springfield, I'm Joshua Pinella, Ozarks First.